So it's nice to be here on the scene tonight. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I'm a little shook up today, so you know, cut me some slack here. I went to the uh, neurologist. I've been having some problems with my memory, and uh, I was sure I had Alzheimer's. I was just scared to death, and I said, uh, you know, Doc, what do I do if it gets really bad? And he said, uh, depends. <laughs> and uh, I said, well, how about my sex life? Uh, and he said, well, Johnny, uh, you'll still have a huge penis, you just won't remember what to do with it. <laughs> but you know, I'm getting up to the age now where I have to stop every now and then and see if I have that old person smell. But I think one of the problems with the memory was uh, the amount of drugs I did earlier. I did a lot of drugs. I, I did enough drugs to kill an elephant <laughs> at Neverland, who did drugs with Michael Jackson. <laughs> a lot of drugs I did. And, uh, but I think what what changed for me was is that yeah I said God help me, God help me for the love of God someone help me. You know I think that was a cry for help. <laughs> so you know what pisses me off is his neighbor, this son of a bitch motherfucker. He sits out in his garage with his bowling pen shaped buddies that all look alike. They drink beer, they play country music, and they shoot off firecrackers. What are you like eleven years old? Uh, firecracker make a lot of noise. So, you know, I, and they all drive these Dodge, these Ram trucks. I got my big Dodge Ram in before, before. And, uh, you know, I just, I, I hate it. Um, so, so they, they'd like to Ram me. That's why they buy the trucks. They want to Ram somebody. And, uh, but they can't Ram me because I got one of those little smart cars. So they try to chase me around. I got smart. Sometimes I get in the back of their uh, pickup bed and they're like, where's that one to Ram that some bitch? They can't find me, but, uh, Got a couple, I got a feature on the smart car. I got the global missionary positioning. So, you know, for women that don't like to. Uh... So, uh, uh, yeah, I got stopped the other day. A uh, uh, policeman pulled me over and he said, uh, Do you have any realize, do you realize how, uh, uh, <laughs> do you ever realize how smart you were driving back there? But then the same night, I got my second DUI. That's, that's bad news. I take that. It's uh, bagpiping under the influence. I'm a bunny, bunny lassie. That's bagpiping under the influence. But you know what uh, uh, gores my ox is, is when you go to buy something now and people don't say thank you. They say, have a good one. It's not connected. It's like, you know, thank you implies that you understand that I've either had to earn the money, steal the money, win the money, or find the money. All of which is very hard to do. But have a good one is like, uh, say I'm out at the lake and it's noon, and I'm swimming out there, and uh, I start to drown, and this guy swims out, he saves me, we get back to shore, and I say, enjoy your lunch. Because they're not connected, they're not connected, and it just goes on us. But so what I do is I'll start to say, have a look at my penis, and I just change it in the last second. Have a wife, I can help you. That's so uh, the other day, this actually happened, I was at the post office, and um, I bought some stamps, and the woman gave me the receipt. She sent the receipt, there's a, a website address if you'd like to go on there and fill out a survey. Well, sure, I have nothing better to do than to fill out surveys. So I said, well, if I don't fill out, are you going to start shooting people again? And uh, she was really funny. <laughs> Not funny at all. And, and I left, and I felt really guilty, and I really did. So I think, I'm going to go back and apologize to her. And uh, I went back. I said, I'm really sorry, that was a poor taste. She said, I accept your apology, and then I'm almost out the door. And she said, you know, we haven't shot anybody in a long time. <laughs> and uh, I used to work in advertising, and I thought, now there's an ad campaign ready to go. United States Postal Service, we haven't shot anybody in a long time. <laughs> that again. So, but you know, it's tough dating women when you start getting older. And I'm not gonna date anybody my age, and I'll tell you, in two words, um, gray pews. <laughs> You don't want to see that. Trust me on that. I don't want to see that. But I started dating a, uh, a vegan, um, I'm sorry, a vampire. And uh, you know, I figured immortality, you know, she was 673 years old, but you know, she looked nice. It was arm candy. And, uh, but as soon as I started going out, she turns into a vegan. You know, my luck. So it pissed me off. So we go out to dinner, and I take my spear to spears and make a cross out of them. Um, tell the waiter, you know, could you stick some garlic into her? Um, saucer. And then my dog turned into a baby. And, you know, I used to, uh, he used to eat his meal in here, garden like that. Now, 
Now when I eat meat, he's uh, he growls at me, you know, self-righteous little fucker. But uh, you know, that's about all I have, honestly. <laughs> 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 You've been such a lovely audience. <laughs>